Welcome to the channel everyone. Um, today I'm going to do a, I guess a little overview of these uh, Rough Country uh, Forge shackles and also the uh, forged uh, winch hook. Um, I just picked these up uh, for my truck and uh, they have uh, I think black, red and this gray. Uh, I will say that this gray is a lot darker than they show in the pictures so kind of be aware of that I thought this was going to be a lot lighter of a gray and give me kind of a, a little bit of a contrast but it's actually a lot darker um, the actual product so I guess be aware of that guys um, they they look like nice nice pieces here they're forged so um, I guess they're supposed to be stronger, I guess. Um, they're not, uh, they're not lightweight. Um, I'm going to install the, the shackles uh, today. I'm not going to install the hook because my winch isn't quite ready. But um, it looks like a good piece. It's got a spring-loaded uh, deal on there to keep whatever you hook on to hooked uh, so it don't come out. Um, I will say there's there's quite a few scratches and dings in the, the I'm guessing it's powder coat they have on this. I mean I guess it's no big deal. I'm not building a show piece, but uh, I guess just be aware of that there will be uh, scratches and and uh, dings in both the hook and the shackles. There's quite a few marks in these shackles where it's gone all the way down to metal, so it's probably going to start rusting. I'm actually thinking about changing the color on these uh, because it's um, kind of a darker gray. I mean, it's going to look okay right now, but I may end up changing the color of these. That's no big deal. It's just a scuff and a paint. But um, one thing I did notice with these is they... They don't really... They're not wide enough to fit on any shackle mount that I have. See this one here I bought, I was going to use it for the front bumper, ended up not using it. But you can see it won't it won't go on that mount. Um, it's not it's not wide enough. So I'm going to go over here um, to my bumper. Okay, so I'm going to go to my bumper here. I got a shackle mount. If my camera will stay focused, and you can see, um, I think I'll be able to squeeze it on there, but it's like a really, really tight fit and it's gonna end up scratching. You can see I've kind of forced it and I've already scratched, no big deal. This thing's gonna swing and, and, and it's gonna probably scratch this anyway. But I'm thinking about um, taking a grinder and, and just kind of opening this up, making this a little wider um, so it fits better on the shackle mounts. This one ain't quite as bad as the one that I bought. Um, I should be able to force that up in there. But I'm not sure why um, it's not a little bit wider. Okay, so a little more information um, on these shackles. The, the pin or the bolt yeah, looks to be like 7 eighths of an inch. And then I'll give you a width here. Um, seems to be, looks like about an inch. It's all, um, yeah, it's less than an inch on the top there. That's that's the problem, I think, is there's less than an inch there. Where they, looks like where they, where it was made, it's got a, a high spot there or something. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to grind that down a little bit. Okay, so the width of these, uh, I'd say, is, is, is an inch on the shackles. 
uh, your opening you are four inches wide opening on the inside is a tiny bit less than two and a half so I'm going to give you a size on this hook uh, looks like uh, it's like five and a quarter inch long and you've got uh, three and a half like three and a half wide there uh, this inside opening is inch and a half and then uh, with this all the way open you got about an inch you got an inch opening there um, if you're trying to fit something in there so you're only going to be able to go around something that's an inch probably less to be able to get it to close so be aware of that okay so say you want to use the rough country hook with the rough country shackles um, it, it will hook onto it like this um, I cannot get this thing to, to close it will not close um, but it will hook on I guess so I'm not sure that's really usable uh, a way to do it but okay so a quick reference here uh, the forged rough country hooks next to uh, these are the cheap shackles that came with my bumper uh, I guess this says uh, three quarter, so it may be uh, a little bit smaller actually than uh, what the rough country is considered. But I mean, there's a standard shackle versus the uh, rough country one. Okay, so after uh, a very small amount of grinding, um, you can see uh, it actually goes on this this mount um, um, easily. Uh, it, it's a little bit snug but I think a little snug is actually better than being really loose but um, yeah just a small amount of grinding and it, it goes right on there guys um, I'm happy that it's easy to do it but now I've scratched it so the uh, the paint is, is the paint or powder coat I'm guessing it's powder coat um, you know it's gonna probably start rust in there so I'm probably gonna have to coat these with something so you know it is what it is um, I think that's kind of rough country's deal is they got they got good stuff but sometimes they they drop the ball on their their quality control but So there we go, both of them installed. I really like them guys. Like I said, if you wouldn't have to, to grind that for it to fit, um, these would really be awesome, uh, awesome shackles. But I guess, guys, I guess that's going to do it for this one. Hopefully uh, you enjoyed the video. And I'll see you.